For 30 years, he preached thousands of sermons, changed thousands of lives, preaching the good news from the pulpit at the First Baptist Church of Bossier. This past Sunday morning, Dr. Fred Lowry passed the staff to a new generation, and I had the privilege of being there. Where do you begin telling the story of a man who has changed so many lives, including your own? You could see them Sunday morning all over the packed sanctuary at First Baptist Church, Bossier. Hands raised, hearts full in the presence of their Lord, the one he introduced them to. For instance, there was Mark Rohde. That's him carrying the cross a while back. He was five years old, virtually homeless when... We're staying across the street in the motel and the church brought us food when we needed, when we were hungry. And then a few, a years, few later, years later... Uh, and Dr. Fred baptized me. Oh, there have been thousands of those since that dark-haired preacher arrived from South Carolina back in 83. God talk about God's man and God's church and God's people. And from the beginning, there was a consistent message. Out of all the things we do, what's the greatest thing we ever do, church? That's to pray. Prayer is the most important thing that we can ever engage in, because when we pray, we get the attention of heaven. There was just something about him. When Fred Lowry spoke, people listened. God says family is priority, not business, not job, family. God first, family second, job third. And hundreds answered the call to ministry. Me coming to Christ, me being called to ministry, all of that happened in that great church under your ministry. Great teen boy under your ministry there at Bossier. I trusted Jesus Christ as my personal Lord and Savior, and my life has never we will never know how many times that happened. We do know the church grew and prospered under his leadership, and people were never the same. That little homeless boy is now on staff at the church that fed him in more ways than one. So yes, there were plenty of tears Sunday morning. Even the ever stoic Dr. Fred got red eyed. You know, we are really, really happy today. And we're really, really sad today. That's just the, the human side of us. It is. And the human side was all around him this morning, holding him close. The lives changed, the marriages healed, the pastors birthed. Through 30 years of one faithful man sharing the good news, plowing the hard ground, and on this Sunday morning, bearing witness to the harvest. He's gone, but he's not going away, is he? He will not go away. He says that he will preach until he dies. That's his calling. That's what he was put on the earth to do. What an amazing man, an incredible teacher. The impact, the ripple effect of his life is profound. He changed my life, and I'm just one of many thousands that have benefited from having known him and been under his teaching. Just an incredible guy. He passed the staff. That staff you saw in the video was actually from Bethlehem in Israel. They had it specially made for the new pastor who everybody loves. They call him Pastor Brad Jerkovich, and he passed the staff this past Sunday morning. So that church is in really good hands, mm -hmm. but they will miss. There's never going to be another one like Dr. Fred Lowry. Incredible guy. Yeah. Thank you so much for that story. Mm -hmm.